5:30. Dangerous drugs. They might look like candy or gummies, but they're actually full of a synthetic new drug. It's an important safety alert for parents coming from the Miami-Dade Police Department tonight. CBS 4's Gabby Fleischman has more on how to spot the drugs and its side effects. What looks like a sweet snack is now being used to disguise a dangerous drug designed to appeal to kids. These dangerous chemicals are out there in rather benign seeming forms and we all need to be careful. During a narcotics bust, Miami-Dade police say they found what looked like candy in a Ziploc bag. Turns out it was laced with a synthetic drug similar to flaca and bath salts. It's a crystal-like drug that's cheap, addictive and deadly. It can be swallowed, smoked or injected and often causes hallucinations and paranoia. There's been a lot of medical problems from the consumption of these products. In this case, narcotics detectives say the drug mimicked the candy's sugar coating. It looked almost identical to regular gummies, but they were stickier and individually wrapped. The crystalline form was crushed up and a piece of candy was rolled in the crystals to make the illegal substances attractive and marketable. This is Miami-Dade County's first case, but Flocka has become a growing problem in South Florida. In Fort Lauderdale, a man on Flocka was impaled on a fence while trying to break into the police department. One month earlier, a person high on the drug thought he was being chased and tried to break through the police department's impact-resistant doors. Then there's the man caught on video running naked down Broward Boulevard. Cops say he admitted he was high on Flocka. It's always a cat and mouse game. Police say new drugs are constantly being created to avoid arrest and target kids, and they want parents to know what's out there before it becomes a serious problem. And these are all things that we want to make sure that we see. If we see it out on the street or we see something of that nature, make sure that we stay away from it. And it's extremely difficult to tell the difference between the drug laced candy and the actual candy. So police say the best thing you can do as a parent is to keep an eye on your kids, see if they have any changes in behavior, and get them help if necessary. From Miami Dade Police Headquarters, Gabby Fleischman, CBS 4 News.